We're still very much in the midst of the coronavirus crisis, but thoughts are already turning to another health threat that we begin to think about this time of year. Of course, flu season is quickly approaching, and Eyewitness News Health Beat reporter Mark Hiller has the story from Wilkesbury. Flu shot or not is a debate some of us may have, but experts say it's as important as ever to get one this flu season. While shopping at Harold's Pharmacy, Rhonda Wydra has something on her mind. I get mine every year. The WAP Wallopin woman plans on getting her flu shot because she remembers when she had the flu. Once a long time ago, and that's why I started getting the flu shot, and I never had it since. We've received our flu vaccines about a week ago, and we have started to have people come in for them. I decided not to put off getting my flu shot, which typically I would get in the fall. Didn't even hurt. All right. I'll You're good. The CDC blames last flu season on up to 56 million infections and 62,000 deaths. It is always easier to prevent a disease than to treat it. And this fall, we will have two very severe respiratory illnesses. A twindemic, as some are calling it, with the flu and COVID-19 coexisting. While there's no vaccine for COVID, there is for the flu. If you can prevent or minimize the illness of one of those two diseases, it is definitely something you need to do. Everyone six months and older is encouraged to get the flu vaccine every flu season, but especially this flu season. The reason it's more important is it is very possible, as they are two separate viruses, to develop both at the same time at which case your immune system would be totally overwhelmed and would have a very difficult course of fighting both of them off. Overwhelming more than patients. Up to nearly three quarters of a million people were hospitalized with the flu last flu season. So we're already worried about hospitalizations from COVID and with both diseases circulating at the same time, it could increase hospitalizations, increase burden on our medical system. You don't need to make an appointment to get a flu shot at the pharmacy, but it is recommended that you have your insurance information handy so that you're not charged for it. With the Health Beat in Wilkesbury, Mark Hiller, Eyewitness News.